Baxters. I managed to track down Adam Taylor, or rather, you managed to track me down. I managed like to that. find you. Yeah, I got a message. <laughs> so I've come to find you. <laughs> I was about to give up. Sweet. So, what is your deal? You're you're really into FPGAs. I am. So I write a, I write a lot of uh, a lot of blogs and a lot of technical tutorials on how to use FPGAs. I use them in my sort of consulting business as well so I've been doing it for what 20 years now so I think I nearly know what I'm doing with them well, <laughs> one day I hope to anyway <laughs> it's one of those things where the more you know the more you know you don't know or something pretty much yeah mm -hmm. there's always somebody there's always somebody smarter and clever that knows more than you do oh they? boy I don't so. know about that uh, so uh, you mentioned that you use them in your consulting practice what are you building with them can you say uh, yeah, I can probably say that. So I'm working. I'm working quite a lot at the moment with uh, an autonomous vehicle application. Ooh. So it uses the uh, uses the larger version of the ZU the ZU 3 EG that we've got on the Ultra 96. I think it uses the nine. Cool. And we're doing a lot of image processing and a lot of high speed networking with it. So it's, it has some challenges, but it's quite good fun so far. It does seem like they're using it a lot for uh, video and like image processing stuff. Like I did two workshops, and they're both about that. I think the I think video and image processing is really, really quite a hot topic at the moment. Plus, it's actually really cool because you get to see something coming out quite quickly. You know, you see a dis you see something on a display, and you're like, "Hey, I created that," as opposed to kind of looking at an oscilloscope, going, "Well, if you look at the second <laughs> harmonic, then you can see the example work." So a lot of exa a lot of labs and stuff are really good are really good around. Uh, That's embedded true. Embedded vision because you get something quick, quite quickly out of it. It's very charismatic. Um, so you have all 20 years of experience in FPGAs. Do you think, feel like you learned anything here? Uh, it's been really good, actually. Yeah, there's been a lot of good sessions. I I've been doing went to a couple of model composer tutorials, so that's quite interesting about using MATLAB to generate uh, algorithms and codes and put them in your Ultra 96. So I thought that was a really good, really good session, actually. Awesome. Um, is there anything that you think people aren't using FPGAs for enough that they should be? Uh, that's an interesting question. I honestly, they're they're quite as the keynote said this morning. We've moved beyond FPGAs. You know, they're quite universal. They're quite flexible. They can be used for a lot of things. Um, I think as an engineer, really, it comes down to picking the right tool for the right job. If you can do it with an Arduino, do it with an Arduino. If you need an FPGA, you need, a, you need an FPGA. And now you can do both at the same and time. And now you can do both at the same time, <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Awesome. Uh, any cool stuff that you're excited about that's coming up? Uh, in your life or other... Uh... In my life? No, I lead a very, bo I lead a very boring <laughs> life. So I'm, I have a one-year-old, well, 14-year-old, 14-month-old son, so I'm just... I was going to say, one to 14, that's a pretty big... Yeah, so I'm just waiting on him <laughs> saying his first words. Wow. So that's the big exciting thing out there. He babbles a lot like a dinosaur, runs around the house, and he can he can walk now, which is quite terrifying. <laughs> so I, I mean, it's really... You kind of spend the first six months thinking, I can't wait till you can move. And then once he stop moving, you're like, oh, stop, be careful, you know. <laughs> so I'm really excited for him to give his to his first words, you know. Amazing. Ho hopefully he's not listening too much and it's the first words on a swear word, otherwise his mother's going to kill me. But uh, well, it's quite exciting. And FPJ-wise, technology-wise, I really want to get my hands on the uh, the Versal device that was announced this morning. Ooh, so. cool. Uh, so, uh, what's your son's name? Uh, Daniel. So how long before Daniel gets his first lightsaber? Did you see uh, the, the I've robot taken, I've got, I've got some light, I've already acquired a few lightsabers and taken them home for him. Excellent. So I needed at least two so I can have a lightsaber battle oh, with yeah, him yeah, yeah, when, he gets, yeah. when he gets bigger. Yeah. Otherwise there's no training. No, 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 that's it. How can I train it, you know? Sweet, thank you so much. No problem, you're welcome. Thank yeah. you very much.